Good afternoon, we made it to Friday. Thank goodness. We're going out to eat pizza again. We're doing deep dish. Friday at Pequod's in Lincoln Park. We're gonna eat the entire week in a massive pie. We got one stop before we go to dinner, and that is Carter's to get Mr. Jamesy Boy's Easter outfit. We successfully picked up James's outfit, and we wanted to show you guys New City on Halstead is another place that we almost lived in. So this is another area we haven't really explored much of. There's an Aldi, Trader Joe's, which makes sense. And there's free parking. We definitely need to come here. And a Home Goods on the corner. Have you ever seen a more massive Barnes and Noble? Like I'm happy to see that. Because you know Amazon, but that's massive. It's even look at it starts down there. Alrighty, my Warren and Webster. Or something about an IPA. <laughs> I got a Coke. And the little baby has awoken. Do you want to see what 75% of what's outside the Chicago basements have? Mm hmm. What do you think it's called? Like a One like framed stadium field of some sort. I mean, what percentage would you say? 75. Yeah. There are the Blackhawks, the Bulls, the Bears, the Cubs, the White Sox. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Somebody. That same Alright, our poppers have arrived. Pequod poppers. I'm so jazzed about this soup. Sarah so got a minestrone soup. <laughs> at, at, oh. <laughs> and someone woke up. He's so happy. I'm so happy. I'll take one. Fun fact about Peter he loves a good salting bread. I do. Arrived. We got all of it with sausage, and then we got half with green pepper and onions, the other half with jarred marrow. And we both got jarred marrow. And we're gonna eat this whole pan oh my God. before we leave. <laughs> sausage is doomed! James wants some. Midway through dinner, this is the piece I'm about to conquer. James has decided to eat with us. So good. So good? <laughs> I think it's like the cheese on the edge. Really good sauce. I really, and also the crust on the bottom is like thin but sturdy. Yeah. Keeps it all together. So buttery. So good. We have conceded. The bill is paid. And the box has arrived. I'm like. I am very full. I'm not uncomfortable. It's because you and me are, we are beasts. If we get up and start walking, we might be good. I just had like one more bite though and I was like... <laughs> <laughs> but I want to enjoy my coffee. Yeah. And he is out. Gonna go to the loop now? Thank you so much.
you will quickly learn as we spend more time in the loop. Am I going over a wheel or a blanket? Yeah. That block 37 is a very big staple in the brook carts hanging out downtown. Because there's the red line and the blue line and it's in the middle of the loop yeah. by all the fun stuff. Right. So it is just... <laughs> it is just something that, and we plus we love it. It gives me, it, it's always been like this, even before we moved to Florida, it gives me Disney Springs vibes. What's funny New is, Disney Springs. when this was being constructed, we thought it was just the Disney store. Like we heard there was going to be a Disney store. We thought it was going to be four story, five story. Right. Disney store. Quickly to find out it was a mall. Yeah, but there used More to be a Disney store that just closed. Sit. Anthropology, yeah. AMC, but chocolate it stores. It even has like similar smells. We are looking at across the street to go to Primark. There's something specific I want for Easter that I saw here last week that I figured we could just swing on by. We have not been to the third floor, which is home. I'm interested to see what home is in Memphis. Ooh. I got this a white tank top and a white t-shirt. They're like four bucks each out of the whole store. <laughs> this is what I'm drawn to the most. Those look comfy. Okay, so the home section here is mostly just like sheets. Is there anything Disney? Aha! Uh -huh. I found some Mickey Mouse. Toy Story. Cute little thumper. Okay, these are super cute. These are just the cutest designs on this bag. If you didn't know, you actually have to pay for plastic bags in Chicago, so it's so nice to have an awesome reusable option right at checkout. Somebody's doing the news August up there. 13th, what? Field, Green Day, Paula Boy, and Weezer. What? 2021? What? Is it old? Well, I feel like it's old. We'll have to look it up. But if it's not old, it's gotta be old. All right, so what I took the camera out to say was, we're taking a longer, oh no, we're taking a longer route to get to the bus to show you something, and it's right here. And it's covered. It's covered. It's our spitting ledge. We weren't going to spit because, you know, pandemic. But when we were dating in high school, for some reason, we would always stop here and there's an alleyway down there. Spit off this ledge like a spitting ledge. And see, see if you can spit fire. Oh, I always spit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, no. Yeah. yeah. Like they're doing they're doing other construction. Can I peek around? Nope. This is arguably one of our favorite spots in all of downtown. My favorite. Our two favorite buildings, the flags. Are you so happy? He is so happy. We stroll up to this plaza. It's like the old NBC plaza next to the Wrigley and Tribune buildings. What is this TBS wipeout? Enter to win wipeout bracket battle. There's only something going on. If it's a TV show, obstacle course, I'm in. Are we coordinated enough? No, but also look at this fancy apple store that we've never been inside, but there's trees. Trees inside this apple store. Look at this big old kid. Just sit him on the couch while I got the TV and everything ready. Did you just go outside? Are you so excited? You haven't even said hi to Jamesy boy. Come on. You got a crazy puppy. We are home and you wanna know what's not a good time to start using cloth diapers? Is when your washer decides to stop working. 
So we're going to bring some laundry to my mom's over the weekend to get done. But yeah, not good timing. Not good timing. Our, our washer will wash, but it just doesn't drain. So we have a service call in and whatnot, but that's where we are in our cloth diaper escapades. <laughs> Are you tickling him too? A little bit of <laughs> Did we show his cute outfit today? He's got all kinds of Mickey and friends on. Oh, he's so mad. Whoa. <laughs> Our rash is looking a little bit better. He took he took a little milk bath today. Oh gosh. We tried diaper ash cream. <laughs> He's trying to say <laughs> he hopes it's on the way out. So the reason we went to Pequods is because Phil Rosenthal went to Pequods and the Chicago episode of Somebody Feed Phil. So now we're gonna watch it, this little segment, and see where he was compared to where we were. And be so happy. Those plates. He's sitting right at the front. They had tabletops, like high tops, before COVID, obviously. Peter says he's going to go get his leftovers from the fridge. <laughs> Do you guys want to know a secret? I, um, oh, that's where we were sitting. I almost threw up <laughs> at the restaurant. <laughs> I, like, started sweating, like, looking around for bathroom like was about to pass peter like no i was about to pass james up to peter i don't know what happened but i'm still full still applying to jobs still applying to jobs i already edited this vlog Alrighty, we have a daily message for april 2nd your head is a living forest full of songbirds ee -E. cummings Alrighty, so we have an early day tomorrow, so I'm just getting us ready for bed and trying to get Peter to be done with his job search for the night. Guys, he he works so hard. Um, any sort of positive pixie dust prayers, you name it, um, in Peter's direction would be so, so appreciated. <coughs> he deserves a job. He he really, really loves. And I can, I can just like feel like that is coming. Um, but again, he's putting in the work. He needs some positive energy sent his way. Um, it only takes one. So hopefully, hopefully that'll be soon. But if you could do that for me, I'd really appreciate it. Good to be home. <laughs> it's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>